It was Christmas time on the island of Sodor. This year has been one of the worst years that Thomas and his friends had ever had. The engines had suffered so many mutations this summer and through the autumn. First, the nuclear plant. Second, Charles. Third, the demon, and the monster mutation. Thomas the Tank Engine has obviously suffered a monster mutation for the past two days. It was as if Thomas is trying to do, to fight the monster for his life, but he couldn't. Until one day, we have found the true story of what happened to Sir Topham Hatt's rail car, Winston. Thomas, I want you to prevent coal cars from the docks and bring them to the quarry. But sir, it's cold outside. I don't care, Thomas. Just go. We will talk about this later. <sighs> later on, Sir Topham had pulled Winston into Napa Station. He got out of his car and went to work. I'll be back in two hours, Winston. So stay seated and relax. Okay, sir. Early days. And for that, Sir Topham had walked inside. Winston waited and waited. Suddenly, Thomas popped up. Winston gasped. He realized that Thomas is a mutant monster. <laughs> Winston began to panic and began to scream. But Sir Topham Hatt didn't hear Winston. Thomas walked away and returned and gave Winston an extra hard shunt. He was pulling Winston out of Napa Station. With no help, the monster Thomas pushed Winston out right into the hot tub factory main lobby station and onto the hot tub on his way to the real hot tub station. When Thomas Francis Winston, Winston found himself right into a water with steam. He was, he was right in the hot tub. Factory. Winston panicked. Thomas was going to push Winston off the tracks and into the hot tub. Help, help, Winston cried. But no one helped. Scattering steams were everywhere. The monster roared and began to move back and back and back. Winston panicked. He thought he was done for. Waters were flapping and steam swirled. But it was too late. Thomas raced fast and pushed Winston into the hot tub. Sir Topham Hatt's favorite rail car is gone. The mutated monster Thomas roared in victory.
Winston found himself death in a super lucky hot water. An hour later, Sir Topham had finished his work, and he went outside so that he could run Winston. But when he stepped out, he gasped. <gasps> Winston, where are you? Sir Topham had looked. There is no sign of Winston. Oh no! Somebody call the cops! The Soto Search and Rescue Team have been called and they got to work finding Winston. But after hours of searching, there is no sign of Winston. Especially Thomas was back to normal. Especially, Winston was nowhere to be found. That is when Sir Top of Hat decided to make an announcement. I have bad news for you all. Winston is dead. He was yet to be pushed off by a mutated monster. A monster mutation. What? Oh my god! Oh no! Cinders and ashes! I will not be able to run any car or rails until we find a new rail car. It has been a very serious, awful mistake, and I do not want to be run out until a new rail car arrives. Yes, sir, we understand. Sir Topham had left. Oh, the indignity! Poor Winston! Bust my buffers! Thomas looked at his friends. He knew he was the one who pushed Winston off the hot tub factory and into the hot water boiled. Boiled alive. So he decided to puff away quietly, so he wouldn't get in trouble. When Thomas saw Birdie the bus stopped at Mallard Station, he stopped to check on him. Hello, Thomas. Birdie, I am so screwed. What's the matter, Thomas? I... I... Thomas? Bertie? I pushed Winston out of the rails and into the hot tub! You did what? Yes, I did. When I was a monster mutation. How? But how did you get the monster mutation back? I don't know, Bertie. I really don't know. I was at Natford Station when something strange happened to me, and I felt like I've become a monster again. Bertie gasped. He realized Thomas is in danger. He knew that Thomas has done something bad. Bertie knew. He wouldn't let Thomas puff forward anywhere, anytime soon, before he gets to be a mutation again. So Bertie raced away to get help. <laughs> and with no time, with the garbage engine, buffered up to Thomas and pulled him out of Mountain Station so he won't get any monster mutations. Oh, thank you for your help, Whiff. It's no idea, Thomas. I'm always here to help. 
I'm glad. I'm sure I'll be back to normal at any time. Unfortunately, Thomas's boiler wouldn't get the secured of any mutation. But that's a Christmas special story. <laughs>